I'm fine, I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. I have the jacket well, thing. Why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Yeah, I was gonna say. Do you wanna hold him? Yeah. Could I? Of course. Your family. Here. Alright, Clem, you better be freaking careful, though. Oh, hi. <laughs> well. Like a big sister. <laughs> Here, let me take him. You both should rest. Especially you. When's the last time you slept, Kenny? Uh, about two years ago. I'm two two years, years ago. Well, somebody's got to watch you while Mama gets your beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. <laughs> I think that may have pulled Kenny out of whatever he was in, thankfully. But I don't know if Jane's okay, because of what happened with Sarah. Oh shit. What are you doing? Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. No, 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 you can't. What about Luke? What about him? Aren't you guys... Look, Luke's a nice guy, but it's not like that. And it can't ever be like that. Oh. Come on, you gotta stay. Well, that's it then. No. You know, Jane... We need her in the group. Sarah, I'm not gonna stick around and... watch it happen to you two. It's not going to. You know the score. I'll be okay. Sure. But give it enough time, and everyone's luck runs out. Not about luck. Listen, Come when on. the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. And when push comes to shove, you'll see. I owe these people everything. They've kept me safe, looked out for me. I wouldn't be here without them. Well, they can't keep you safe forever. No one is safe forever. Come on. Just stay in the group. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Oh, she's not going to, is she? Here. The nail file? That's helpful. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah. I, uh... I gotta go. Alright, I guess she's really set on leaving, but, I mean, we could really use her in the group still. I mean, she is family, after all. We escaped Carver's place together. But I guess she doesn't see it that way. She's gonna just be on her own. I wonder if we'll run into her sometime later in the down the line. Hey, Luke, how's it going? Hey, thought you'd be asleep by now. You okay? Um. It's nothing, Luke. Don't worry about it. Okay, just checking in with you. It's okay. <sighs> Temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. Yeah, I agree. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore. Oh, see if we that's can find some not place gonna to happen. What? Jane's gone? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? She's like... Damn it! Yeah, I didn't think you would take that too well, but... Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit. Childish? God damn it, Kenny. You know what? Just 
Lay off. No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two can roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. What do you want from me? Kenny's uh. just trying to protect the group. Well, coming down on me isn't helping. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer, and Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit. So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine, but this baby, he's what matters now, got it? So get your shit Jane, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. All right. We're gonna need a good I place to they fight which so ain't much. here. We gotta push on. We head north. Get to Wellington. Yeah, That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. We can check it out, but or at least really... it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny. I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. A whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa. What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days at, at the least. Yeah, We've Rebecca does need... Formula. She does and need to rest. The rest of us. And what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Luke's right. She needs to rest. We should wait a few days. Maybe that's for the best. I mean, best. it's not so We don't want to push Rebecca too hard. Just give me a day or two, Kenny. I'll be fine. This is a mistake. Look. We should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day. We can go scout out the town, check it out in the first few days, and depending on what we see, we can make a choice from there. I mean, what's wrong with that? <laughs> we can't just force her to travel, though. Okay, Bex. It's gonna be alright. <laughs> Snowing. It's a good thing we found that code at the museum, especially now. Oh. But yeah, that's the other thing. She's exhausted. We all are. Well, Kenny's not entirely wrong, but you know, yeah, she does not look so good. We should have left right away instead of waiting around. We could have found more food and been someplace warm days ago. We did the right thing. She was in no condition to move. She's worse now. We could still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You Here's don't even thing. listen to anyone They're else. You just right. go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up. Okay, you're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done. Like always. You're not helping anything by arguing. Well, don't forget you agreed with me about waiting to leave camp until today. I'm just saying, it's not worth arguing about. We just have to keep going. Uh oh. Oh here. This place is it. Why can't we just all huddle together? Rebecca, let me take the baby. Oh, he's okay. I've got him. No, you rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being Shh. weird about it. Yeah, you kind of have been. And not just, just right now. Listen to Luke for now. It's Rebecca's decision. It's Rebecca's baby. Trying to help. We understand, Kenny. It's... Hello? What is this? Oh, God. It's that Russian guy. Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. That's the guy? You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? We don't know what he wants. He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Please? He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. 
I don't right. necessarily trust him, but I mean... This, I don't think this is good. I don't think this is good. Hello, your name is Clementine, yes? Hi, yeah. Arvo. These are your friends? Yep. I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. Uh-oh. What do you need? How can we help? I need, uh, uh, things for bandages. I need bandages. Okay. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Arushi! Nikaki Arushi! Oh my gosh. Nikaki Arushi! You son of a... We should have ah. just killed him. Not again. Это они? Да. Это они. Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что мы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю? Чтобы... We don't want any trouble. Come on, just let us pass through. I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? We didn't rob him. They want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on now. What the hell? Why get excited? Clementine, you robbed this guy? No, you aren't taking anything from us. They're not telling me to ask. So what is Josh? Come on, we didn't even take anything from him. I wish we could have met differently, Clementine. You were kind. That is not common. What is that? No. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. If you put your guns down, we will too. Oh, should have said we had a baby. Should have said we have a baby. Arvo, что происходит здесь? The fuck is she saying? Why get excited? Come on, calm down. Come on, calm down, everyone. You have a baby with you? У них грудничковый ребенок. Come on. Can he? Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking shoot it. I'll do it. Drop it. Drop it. Don't fucking don't move. Come on, guys. Come on. We have to be calm about this. We can talk this out. Uh oh, Rebecca. Rebecca. Oh no. Say something, Clem. Oh no. Help! Rebecca, no! Oh man. No! Oh my god. What just happened? Oh my god. I can't even, I, wow. Oh my god. Well, that, that ending, oh man, I hate that ending. Alright, let's take a look at the choices. I mean, I hate it because we don't know what happens. Oh, they're going to keep us guessing for until episode 5 comes out. Like, what? There was so much gunfire. I mean, how did everyone just not die right there? I don't know. I Oh, my gosh. And Rebecca, and oh, my... Wow. Just, I did not see that coming. And stupid Arvo. All right. Let's check this out. My choices. Episode 4, Amid the Ruins. Pragmatism left Sarah at the trailer park. You and 55% of players saved Sarah at the trailer park. Okay, well, that's good. I was in the majority for all these now that I look at them. Compassion robbed Arvo. You and 60% of players refused to steal from Arvo, which we probably should have done, but... I mean, he would have... It would have ended up the same way, and... I, th I think... I mean, it may have been different if we had the medicine... For Rebecca, I, I'm really not sure, but I can't believe it ended like that. It just okay. Enough about that. <laughs> Selflessness crawled through ticket booth. You and 57.9% of players volunteered to crawl through. Nurturing held the baby. You and 55% of players held the baby. Survivalism shot Rebecca. You and 57.3% of players 
did not shoot Rebecca. Um, I kind of just wanted someone to grab the baby so they would see. And, you know, because Kenny just went and shot her. And I think the other group interpreted that as, you know, they're, you know, they just heard the gunfire. So then they started shooting. So I think that should have been handled differently, but it didn't get handled differently. So this is going to be really interesting. Um, I might have to cut the video here for credit music, though. So um, just in case, I'm going to do an outro now. This is my safety outro. So, um, yeah, that was The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 4. I cannot wait until Episode 5 comes out. Cannot wait. Just no. Come on, Telltale. you got to come on with this freaking episode. Oh, man. What? I'm still in disbelief of just every, everything just happened so fast. Like, it started out slow and just ended up okay here all the things are going to happen i mean it didn't really even start out that slow but just it was a little bit of yeah i don't know i have to take this all in anyway that's gonna do it for me for today so thank you all so much for watching and really hope you enjoyed this episode of the walking dead and i will see you in the next episode till then goodbye everyone have a good day